hello everyone welcome back to my channel welcome back to Colin UG in this video we are going to be unlocking the Airtel MiFi the if you have the MTN if you have the Airtel if you have the ZTE if you have these new MiFi is yeah, for Airtel MTN we are going to be unlocking them they look like this you have this here yeah? this one this is what you are going to be unlocking this one yeah this is what you are going to be unlocking if you have whether mtn or airtel or zte zte my fi we are going to be unlocking that yeah sit down relax enjoy the video so Make sure that you have removed your SIM card. Make sure that you've removed the SIM card from the MiFi. Yeah? I've already removed the mine. So, when you remove the SIM card, when you remove the SIM card, you are going to simply, you are going to simply extract the file go to the file this software uh, i think when you inbox me eh? if in, if you are in need of this software you will inbox me and i'll give it to you so you go to extract here this software which i'm using to extract in case you don't have it so even even this uh, my file software if you want it yeah i'll give it to you yeah so what you do is to install the drivers may may i don't wish to first extract the software but you can extract it if you want actually may i already have it extracted it is there i already have it extracted so uh you first install the drivers yeah that's what i'm doing i'm installing the drivers you come to setup.exe you double click it opens you click on yes you come on zte usb drivers you click on yes to install those drivers yeah okay so when you are done then you come to the software you open the software uh, you scroll down until you see zdtetermino.es until you see that one i think it's the last one down you double click to open it yeah when you open it it will look like this it will be like this but this one is not going to be there let me let me show you how exact it will be let me first take everything back and I show you how it looks when it's not opened. So, please watch the whole video such that you don't make mistakes. Don't skip anything in the video. This video will help you. If you skip anything, it may not work well for you, okay? So, this is how the software will look. When it's loading if you're in need of the software and you want it please contact me i'm going to leave my whatsapp number in the description so let's let it update so as it updates you see here it shows no usb oh there is there is already a con i had already connected my my fi that's why it showed the model IMEI and it was showing that device ready because I already connected the MiFi yeah? some time back. So what you have to do is come go to your this PC no matter where you find it just go there right click go to manage when you go to manage it will do what you go to device manager click you see when you come here we are looking for the comports here when you look here there are no comports 
so what you are going to do is get get your MyPy and connect it to the computer having installed those drivers yeah so it's now detected when the MyPy is detected it's going to bring the com ports that's what i'm looking for uh-huh these ones these com ports com and rtp if you are seeing these then you are on a safe side if at all you don't see them come here to drivers and click here and click on ZTE drivers. I know you have to first extract, then you click here on SCIS on SCSI.exe. Then, as soon as you click there, you press OK, then the driver will be detected. Then the my file then the driver then the MyFi will be detected because they are the drivers that enable you to detect the MyFi. okay so when you open it and you've connected everything simply come when you detect it i think it will show device ready it will show device ready then you have to go to sw path to choose the path you remember we have already extracted the so the firmware eh? so you are going mine is on desktop desktop under desktop i put mine here it's under softwares let me locate mine where are you? So, mine is on ZTE software. This is where I put it. So, it is under under ZTE. It is here. ZTE firmware update. You come and click ZTE firmware update. Cause me the files are here. ZTE firmware update. Uh-huh. Under firmware update, it is under firmware. So you click on any. These are the options which will be available. So if I want to put in to change the software, I can put the default ZTE software. Because this is how we unlock them. You choose one. So me have chosen that one. You simply click OK. Uh if at all you've not understood. You see, it's showing device is ready. Then you click here to flash. Make sure that you do this when you have removed the SIM card. Let me show you what happens immediately. I click. Uh, let me click. So, as soon as you click, the MyFi goes off because it was all off. Now I think you see what's happening on my screen. It is downloading. I think you are seeing mine. The MyFi is off and it's downloading the firmware into the MyFi. So sometimes if yours doesn't complete, make sure that I'm going to so wait for it to reach a hundred my my file is off and after the download after updating the firmware the my file will automatically go on ah, you see now the my file is successfully unlocked so for anything or any other